to start this exercise, the first step to switch off the IDU unit and disconnect the power cable. Also disconnect all other cables including the even connectors, IF cable and the ground cable. After disconnecting all the cables, unscrew the screws which are used to mount this box in the rack. Make sure that box should not fall down. Remove the box from the rack for the card installation. You have to unscrew all the 11 screws on this chassis to remove the top cover. The screws are located on both the sides of the cover as well as the back side of the cover. Remove all of them. Please make sure to collect all the screw and keep them aside safely because you are going to use it later. To open the top cover, lift the top cover slowly and pull it back. Now after opening the box, you can remove the old PM card by unscrewing the two screw carefully and detaching the PM card from its slot. The new PM card you have to connect on the same position carefully. Use the same screw to fix new PM on its position. LAN card interface for V4 is provided in a small bag. Before you open the bag, you need to check the label on the packing. Check the part number should be H0098C. When you open the label on the package, you will find there is a stud on the back side of that label. You have to remove that stud and that will be used for LAN card installation. Now we will see the procedure of installing the support stud which has come with the LAN interface module. First remove the screw to install the support.